Hey man, stay man. I got some news for y'all today, man. Hey man, I want to speak on that boy for net two time, man. You know, for net two time back in the news once again for a situation at his show. You know, um, it was a fight broke out. I think it was in Kansas City, if I'm not mistaken. You know, a fight broke out. You know, with the promoter. I guess they said, uh, the promoter was trying to get some dudes off stage because the dudes went over their time limit. You know, um, when you do shows, you got a time limit of when you be on stage. And once you get off stage, another artist come on stage and perform. And I guess the dudes was going over that time limit and the promoter was trying to get out my stage. And, you know, they said that the fight broke out, you know, allegedly. You know what I'm saying? But it is video of a fight. And Finesse wasn't even there. You know, he spoke out on the situation and said, man, I wasn't even at the show. You know, I don't know if he was on the way or he couldn't make it or whatever, but he wasn't there. And if you watch the video, you see he wasn't there. You know, none of his people was there. But it's just crazy because it's like, you know, people tying his name to a situation just by being his show. So it looked like, okay, dang, Finesse two times once again, a fight at his show. You know, and that creates negative energy. You know what I'm saying? You'll have promoters not want to book him. Security will be afraid to, you know, be security for him at his shows. You know what I'm saying? Because you got this stigma, you know what I'm saying, around you concerning your shows. You know what I'm saying? In this situation, unfortunately, he wasn't even there. But by being his show, people attaching him to it. Which is, you know, it's messed up, but that's how it is. That's the internet. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know, Finesse Bailey said, why y'all couldn't just say a show in Kansas City? Why y'all had to say Finesse two times show? Y'all could have just said a concert in Kansas City, a fight broke out. But they had to attach his name. So, you know, I get him on it, him being on parole or whatever, and he can violate and go back. You know, but, you know, this just let you know a rapper's job is dangerous. Everybody want to be a rapper and, you know, have the females, the money, the chains, and woo woo woo. But, you know, if you notice, a lot of rappers be depressed. You know what I'm saying? The job is dangerous. Have, having to try to maintain a tough image and, you know, making sure you don't go for nothing at all times and you got cameras on you and you can easily end back up, you know what I'm saying, in jail and things like that. You know, a rapper job is very dangerous, you know what I'm saying? But, Y'all let me know what y'all think about this situation in the comments. I'm gone.